uh, is different about this, and, and do you accept Welshman's characterization that a lot of the institutions of free and fair uh, democracy are not yet in place? I, I think, um, first of all, I want to turn the question around and uh, make us realize that uh, we've got power. It's not the politician who should be deciding whether the elections are free and fair. What role do you have? Um, I think we've already hear people disagreeing. But this is very important because we, are we fodder for politicians or we can give guidance to politicians? The decision is ours. Do we, I'll come back to your, to your question now. The, I think at the end of the day, do we vote on issues? What is it that makes us go to the ballot? I, I think it's a fundamental question. For as long as we think that the politicians are the ones who cause us to be violent and not us and something in us, we've got a problem. Let's take accountability. I think that's, that's our problem. We always want to point the finger at somebody else. Somebody is responsible for throwing the stone, and who is that person? Is it a politician? Um, you, let me get your, to your question. I agree generally with what uh, my three colleagues have said. There is the issue that Washman speaks, talks about, the issue of um, we have a trust deficit in this country, and it's going to take us a long time to get a point where we, tr we, we trust each other. Um, there is a lot that Zach needs to do to convince people that they're running the elections the right way. And I think right now, Zach is not doing a very good job. There are a lot of people here who believe 